Yo, welcome back to another jailbreak video. I'm just on my alt that I paid the season pass for, and as you can see, I'm level 9, about to get level 10, so let's finish these contracts. Alright, I got the extra Shogun. I'm hoping to sell it for some good overpay, but I'm going to show you guys the best offers that I can find. To start, I traded it to my main. I will say I've noticed that the value is rapidly dropping. I haven't gotten as many overpay offers. You can see I'm getting a lot of Brulees and Javelins. They are still really great offers, but I think you can get a little bit more for a few more days. This is what, around 2.75 Brulees. That was a really good offer. And then another Javelin. That's not the greatest. I will say that I spent a lot of time trying to find these offers. Offer. This guy was offering either Bagnet or Celsius for it. That's pretty good, honestly. If you get an offer like this, you should probably take it, but I'm hoping for a little bit more. And here's another Javelin offer. At least they're doing a little bit of ads. And another offer with Javelin. This one had a really good ads. I got a few random offers of uh, seasonals like banana car and then also some 4x4s and stuff. But I would say until the end of this week, you should probably look for around two brulees or more still. But also, like I said, the value is rapidly dropping. It was hard to find a lot of these offers. And this one is just a joke. I don't know what this guy was doing. I got way too many offers with Javelin in them, so if you want to get a Javelin, just make sure you get some good ads with it. And this was a really good offer, a little bit over two Brulees in value. This was something that I probably would have taken if it was a little bit later. I was getting kind of desperate, so I just gave up and then took this Icebreaker. It's really high times traded, but I'm hoping I can still downgrade it and make good profit. Definitely not the best offer, but it's still a W. Also, I didn't mention it, but the Shogun has this feature, Overdrive. Whenever it goes past 140 miles per hour, it starts speeding up pretty well, and that helps it get to 200 miles per hour. But as you can see here, it has a real top speed of around 400 miles per hour. That was just a joke, but the Shogun is overall a good looking car with decent driving capabilities. Its driving capabilities aren't anything too impressive, so I don't think its value will stay very high. If you're unlocking the Shogun, all I can say is best of luck trading it and thank you for watching. Here's some more jailbreak videos you might like to watch.